Warning, the following content may contain elements that are not suitable for some audiences. Viewer discretion is advised. Welcome everybody back to another episode of Your Truck Simulator 2 and we have some good news. Um, I know it's been a while since I've been in this Euro Truck even though it seems uh, like a very long time but really it has only been a week and um, also with that being said so I'm glad we're back in here I really am but I'm also eager to announce that neither has SES they have not forgot about us but before we continue on with that uh, let's turn on our wipers so we know where the hell we're going here and what we're hauling well that was a very interesting question what we're hauling it's gonna take us a uh, pretty long time uh, we are hauling neon 11 tons of it uh, to Toronto to Toronto uh, I think that's in Italy and we're expected uh, Friday early in the morning and then as you can see it's Wednesday just about uh, just about evening time so it's about a two day trip that we'll be doing and overall it is a 677 mile trip that we're gonna have to do and we're 18 miles away from it so with no further ado let's get started here let's turn that off so anyways so what uh, so what they are doing is this very simple plan is they are expanding more about France so what that means is that they're doing a DLC on expansion to France and what they're saying is they're going to be doing more like more updating kind of things on France and stuff so that's always going to be good so they have not forgot about you guys. I just want to make sure I'm going to be driving on the right side of the road because I am so used to driving American truck. So, anyways, that is what their that is their plan. So, uh, updated and further into more cities, they're saying pretty much on um, for France is coming. So. They have not forgot about you guys. It will be, it will be here. So that is, I'm really excited for that. I don't want ninth. I want seventh. So that is always good. So other than that, that is pretty much all about your truck. Uh, any news, anyways, that are coming that I have found out about. Um, also. If you would like to drop by, as my signal does not want to shut off, um, I am doing my first three hour live stream tomorrow at uh, 7, 7 p.m. Central Time. So if you want to. Oh, and you're speeding because we can't. And it wants us in 10th, and we don't want to be in 10th. Um, so it's going to be my first three hour. Um, live stream non-stop so come drop by um, you know say hello whatever the case and you know have some fun I will I will be enjoying it so that's all about that and then your truck about uh, updating and redoing France so always always keep that in mind um, I hope everybody's Friday is doing good. It is, we are what, like seven hours before the weekend. So I hope everybody is going to be enjoying the weekend. I know I will with this live stream that's coming up. And uh, I get off early tomorrow. I have a princess day. Why does my signals do not want to shut off? Um, so I have a princess day tomorrow. So that's going to be fun and exciting. And then I, um, what you call it? I totally forgot, I lost my train of thought because of the stupid turn signal. Oh, and then Sunday I have off. So that is always going to be, that's going to be fun for me. Not going to do anything on Sunday and then I work Monday. So 
and had these fun in the sun. But yeah, so hope you guys will enjoy your weekend. I know I will, and hope your Friday is doing good. Mine will be good as long as I don't get blown halfway across the street. Um, winds are pretty crazy on where I'm at. Uh, cold front went in earlier today. It was up 60, they were saying like 61, 62. And uh, the cold front just went through when it dropped a little bit, didn't drop too crazy. And it's about, they're saying about like 50, 59, but still is, it's still gorgeous weather to me. Oh, look at that sun. Oh my god, that's bright sun. Oh my god, that's amazing. So, that's always, so that that's what's, that's what's going on, but the wind is just crazy. People forgot to bring in their floor mats. So a lot of people's floor mats are just blowing across the courtyard. And somebody's package from Amazon is in the middle of the courtyard. So if you're watching this and you are wondering where your package is, it is in your courtyard. Somewhere in the courtyard. That is if the birds or the squirrels have not gotten into it to make their own home yet. So you might want to be... Might want to be... Oh yeah, I forgot speeding offense, two miles an hour, and they get you for it. So, that is the the crazy part about it. So, it is what it is. Now, kind of getting off your truck and get into something more um more a little more about games. I know. Oh my God, that made no sense. How are you going to go from 50, drop to 43 for like a quarter of a mile and then be like, okay, now you can go back to 50. Just makes no sense. Um, I totally, I keep forgetting. That's, that's sad. Um, oh yeah, so I made a long dark video, um, if you guys haven't seen it, um, earlier this week or last week. And <laughs> in the in the video I died, and I mentioned that I will not be playing the game again because I'm just sick and tired of dying. It just to me, there's just no point in it for you guys, anyways, because you just you're gonna see the same thing over and over and over again about me dying. And uh, it's gonna get boring for you guys. So and it gets boring for me too. Um, so I said in the video that I will not be playing the game anymore. I I might. I don't know yet. Um, I do have it on the schedule today to make a video today for it. So I may or may not. I, I really don't know yet. Um, and if I do, it's probably not going to be in Mystery Lake. It's probably going to be in another area. See if we have maybe better, better chances. Maybe it's just Mystery Lake just don't want us. <laughs> so it's in a way they're trying to kick us out. So I, I don't know. We, we, we'll see. That is the plan anyways. Um, but still don't know. We will see. Ooh, looks like we're coming up to a tow booth, maybe. No, that is not a tow booth. Don't really know what that is. So yeah, so with this trip, we're definitely gonna have to rest. Um, at least, I, I, well, of course, once, obviously, once the, um, but maybe twice. I really don't want to rest twice. Um, so. And if this was ATS, I would speed a little bit more because they are a little more forgiving. Unlike your truck, they really aren't, as you just seen a couple of minutes ago. While well, I was doing 52 and a 50, and they still gave me a $900 ticket. So, um, you know, I really don't want to speed. So this is just how it's going to be. And plus, I don't want to destroy this. This is the one thing I forgot to mention. It is a fragile and a um, class 2 ADR so class 2 hazmat um, so it will give me bonus for the fragile and for the class 2 hazmat that I have money and X and XP so I really don't want to do any damage 
do this because if I get everything out and done and good and I get this to where it's good and where it needs to go with no you know with no damage and not late then I will receive I will get paid 30,000 euros so um, so that is a lot of money because it can really help me on paying off some of my some of my bank loans that that I have in Euro Trucking, which is really bringing down my business and not allowing me to make as much money as I really want to. Um, I know I said when ATS was going to come out, I would be doing things a lot different, and uh, in ATS I am. I don't have as much debt as I do in American Truck Simulator. Um, so I'm definitely watching that. Um, I only have two loans out, and I do not plan on getting any more loans until at least one of them is paid off. And uh, even though I'm leveling up and I can upgrade my truck, I um, will not do that until I get that loan paid off. So, you know, in a way, you know, I'm doing better, um, you know. So that's what it is. I will do an, um, an update uh, on my on, EA, on ATS next week when I do my video for next week. I will show you how much the, the company is making, how much my the garage is making, and my driver and all that. Give you a little update and all that. She has leveled up quite a bit, um, you know, since I think I discussed about me hiring her. So that's always good. Um, but that is all, um, like I said, I am going to, it's really hard for me to keep your truck, your truck, and ATS, ATS, but I am really trying to, so, but that's all I'm going to say about ATS, so if you want, um, if you, if you want to see it and see how my progress is and, and all that and kind of compare it to this video, then you can, if something tells me they're going to be either construction zone or they'll be merging into one lane here so you can always uh, you'll see it uh, yeah one lane you'll see it next week uh, sometime next week uh, I gotta look I got this I gotta look and I also and then tomorrow I also gotta do my scheduling for March uh, so I know what videos to do and, and all that so I, I I and this is the other thing I just remembered now that I've been talking about games is I might replace Long Dark with another game I know I said that in my last video so I really might do that they have two of my games on sale for just ridiculous it's just with oh horsies oh it's a white horse Sorry, got distracted by horses. <laughs> um, so, do we need fuel? No, we do not need fuel. So, um, they have a couple of the games that I that I have on my wish list on sale, and it's like 80. One of them is 80 percent off. The other one is like 92, 95 percent off. So, in reality, I can get both the games that I want for literally. things like six dollars for both so I'm not gonna complain about that six dollars for two games not bad I won't tell you which ones they are I might do one for my live stream tomorrow so if you guys are interested and want to know what game that will be um, join me on my live stream and then you'll see what game I purchased um, don't forget guys, Hitman Beta has started or is about to start. So always keep that in mind keep that in mind guys. And then also Division Beta has started if I'm not mistaken. Um, when you pre but you can only get the beta when you pre order it. So keep that in mind guys. You only get the beta when you pre order the game. Which I think you can go through Steam, but I don't know if you get the better. I know if of course if you go to GameStop you do. Um, and then Hitman, um, there's the there's the open beta for Hitman on Steam. 
so you can always do that. Um, those are the two games I might be getting um, in the in the future when I get my when I get a better computer and all that. I'll definitely uh, in a way help out. So, but uh, we'll see when we when we get there and all that. All right. So now we're back down to 31. I really don't like that. I'm gonna stick to 51. Actually, no, 51 is too fast. It's too fast for me. Oh, now see, now it goes back to 53. Just makes no sense. Oh, man, we better start slowing down. We better start slowing down. Before we take this corner at, you know, 50, 51 miles an hour. Alright, of course we got a yield. Alright. The one thing. The one thing that I'm not used to is by me switching games is I'm used to the feedback on ATS and on Euro Truck I don't have it. So when I'm playing Euro Truck I have a smooth, you know, ooh, six four thousand dollars, Jesus Christ. Um no energy level up. You know, no, it's just smooth. There is no, there is no force feedback in the game, unlike ATS, where there is force feedback, and I have it. And it, it's just, it's different when you, you know, making, you know, taking cor corners and corners, oh, good grief, taking corners and all that. You, you can feel it, you know, and all that. So that is the one thing I'm not used to. So, it is what it is. Rest, um, well, it's been about three hours. Um, I think our rest is 11. So, 11 minus 3 is not 10, 8. Is 8, so we have 8 hours left. Of, oh, let's not get the car wheel. Really trying not to, uh, really, really trying not to destroy this destroy this I don't know where you got him. Yeah, that's what I thought. Alright, gotta slow down because now the speed limit's at 31. And everyone else is gonna wanna do 31. Alright. So yeah, that's that's the one thing is I gotta get I gotta get used to it. My plan is anyways I, now, of course, depends on how long this takes. This may be a two-parter. Um, really depends. Um, my Euro Truck videos are usually um, 30 minutes or roughly about that time. So it depends on exactly how long I may, you know, I may just do this, you know, do it halfway or, or just full. So, it is what it is, but we have not, I have not decided yet. I have not decided. Oh, come on, turn, you stupid truck. Thank you for turning. But anyways, what I'm hoping... That I'll be able to fuel and then rest instead of fuel and then rest or rest and fuel I want to do both at the same time and, and the other difference and I know I said I was going to make a, a video on the differences and I still might but the other big difference I noticed from ATS to uh, ETS Is the fact that the weight of the uh, what? Wow! One damage. Of course, you had to ruin it for me. 
because you're just a big butt munch. That's just poopy. Yeah, I don't care. <laughs> so, um, you can just feel the, you can feel the, the weight difference from ATS to your truck. Your truck, you don't really feel it. Like, it just, like, you know, 11 tons is, is pretty, is, is heavy. Um, and this truck can just, just take it and no problem. You know, you can start off in 7th gear and have no issue. But in ATS, at 11 tons, if you're hauling something at 11,000 pounds, you can't do it in 7th. The engine will stall. Now, of course, that could be maybe because they tweak things or, you know, it could be a smaller engine, whatever the case may be. And that's also kind of the other reason why I'm waiting on... I'm doing a comparison because I want kind of the same engine horsepower with ATS also with ETS so it's a fair comparison so I I don't say well you know ATS you know you can feel the feel the weight but you know it's because the engine is 200 how horsepower less than you know, when you're a truck, so it, it, that's that's the issue. Um, so that's also what I'm waiting for. But like I said, it could be that uh, I'm gonna have a little twisty in the road here. Slow down, pop it in the eight, and turn on the high beam so we know when the curve comes. All right, that's so much easier. You know when these curves are coming. So we have 12 hours, 491 miles to go. To go, boy and girl. Let's pop it in the 10th here. But yeah. I was watching some of my uh, people in my group live streams yesterday. That was enjoyable. Um, one of them played um, Fallout which I am planning on getting Fallout Las Vegas um, shortly in about a month or two maybe possibly uh, so he was playing that that was fun and exciting and then the other one was playing Warcraft not really into Warcraft to tell you the truth never been in it um, who knows me because I never had the white the right equipment but um just just to me I just did not uh, I just did not enjoy it um so I never got into World of Warcraft none of them so that is what I that is what I so I never anyway so I never got into it so I anyway, just keep saying I I I I I <laughs> A broken record. I um. So yes, yeah, so we've been you know play that and then switch from World of Warcraft to Borderlands 2, which I do have and I do want to play this weekend. So I am really really excited for it. I was able to slow down so I don't slam into her. Kind of want to keep my pace at 60. Put the mayhem the camera. There it is. Oh, they have one in here somewhere. Because it would have gotten me. Because I did not have, I 
I was I did not slow down in time. trying to do is see if I can bring down that time way below um, for my next rest so I don't either cut it close or I don't um, or I don't have to rest again because even though it gives me 24 hours was it 24 or was it 48? I don't remember if it's 24 hours they have if they give me to complete it, which makes no sense because it was only Wednesday, so 24 hours would have been Thursday, so it would have been about 8 hours shy of, of Friday. That's never, um, so yeah. Uh, but I just don't want to rest again, that, that's, that's my thing, I just really just don't want to rest again, rest twice, so I'm thinking it's probably going to be 48 hours, so right now you're minus 6, 48, that's 42, uh, you know, minus, so um, that's 6 hours, right, 6 hours, that's 11, so that's 5, so, Minus another five from there, so that should put us at five hours. So that's what it should put us at is at five hours. So you know, um, and that will give us plenty of time to when we rest and then go finish the the thing to finish the run. It will still give us five hours on the on the drive clock. So if we get hung up, God forbid we flip, accident, whatever the case may be, run out of gas, we have that extra five hours instead of trying to, you know, gain time back and go speeding and all that. And, and that's the other thing I don't do in ATS is I don't speed. Uh, eight, uh, 55, the old double nickel, is what I do. I don't do nothing more than that, no matter what. And I definitely do slow down on, on turns, um, and I take my time, I, I do not rush it. So, that is the one thing I don't do, I just take my time. That is just what I do, just take my time. Yeah, I don't go, I don't go, you know, balls to the walls on ATS, I do take my time, I do take the game seriously, and, uh, you know, so I don't want to, really don't want to mess it up, mess it up, mess it up, so. Alright, we'll pass these truckers over here. And we're about to come around this curve. Once again, I'm 
trying not to damage. Now I'm not trying to damage any more than what it is. So what I'm trying not to. Is there a random? Is there a, is there a car park right there? Random. Gas here, but it kind of coast. Alright, let the momentum take it up the hill. And on this curve. And then accelerate out of it. That's the other thing, guys, is you gotta learn to break going into the curve and accelerate coming out. Now, depending on how fast you're going and depending on how sharp the curve is, you may not be able to apply your brakes and slow down to the to the right speed before you get as you normally would at it you know um before you enter the um before you enter the the curve um so you might have to be slow down even more or slow down earlier than than you normally than if you were you know doing 30 so that's the other thing, like this curve up here, I'm going to have to slow it on down. And we got three minutes of this stream, well not the stream, but this video, so I will be looking for a sleeping and a gas station really damn, really damn quickly here. I just looked over at my gas gauge and that's pretty low. It's going to tell us that we need to get fuel soon. If not, we will run out of gas. We do have a tow road and we do have a sleeping arrangement. So at this tow road, I will pull over to the side and look at the map and see if there's any gas stations and sleeping areas close. Um, let's see my fuel 26 gallons 125 more miles to go so you know obviously that's not going to be enough to take us that's about a little less than half of, of how much we need to go so 25 uh, 25 gallons and 122 miles is just that they have a far right open. That is what I like to hear. This is a O. Someone is going to pull in here really quick and see what this is all about. <laughs> Actually, we can pull in right here. Hopefully, people will take us. Well, hit the pole. Got a lot of new poles. Here, let's look at the map very quick. Alright. So we did quite a distance. We started here. And we're going all the way here. Now, 
this is France here guys this is you see this line right here actually let me zoom in this line this is not a road this is what they divide um France and Germany and this is and this is France Dylan Cleve Lyon Paris haven't been to Paris yet haven't been a lot of these roads haven't even been to a lot of these places as you can see I still got a lot to un to uncover um but we are here so we just I think this is gonna be not Italy so I think Italy is about here I think this is Rick off of Italy let's look why not Actually, no, we are in Italy. We're about here. So we are in Italy. And, yeah, so as you can see, this is, this one breaks off France. So, when, when I said that they are going to be expanding France, so they're probably going to be putting in more cities on this side and, and, and all that. So that is something I'm really grateful for. So anyways, let's look at the map map now. Uh, I should have hit the world map on the bottom, but I just did not, because I'm just a bunch of a goofball. Alright, uh, we do have one right here, and it is a gas and sleeper. Oh yeah, we should be able to make that. Alright, let's cut off the parking brake, turn off that, and uh, let's roll. Yeah, we should be able to make that, no problem at all. So yeah, we should be able to get there, no problem. Still have 117 miles, 116 now. And I don't don't think it's uh, 113 miles, you know, from where we are to there, so. Uh, so yeah, so as you can see, just popped up saying that we have uh, low fuel, and that popped up about 110, 113 miles to empty. That's about 20, that's about 22, 23 in, um, gallons left in the tank. So that is, so that's good. At least it gives you a little bit of a time to tell you, you know, instead of saying, oh yeah, well, you know, here's, we're about to run out of fuel and we only got two miles left. Alright, let's start slowing down here. Which is also how the sun is rising in the background in the mirrors just look at that guys that is so so awesome don't get me wrong your truck really did it but ATS makes it a little more better even though I still prefer it even though it's not completely dark in, in ATS you can still kind of see like orange glow um there's one thing I do wish that they will that they could change is that and um you know be able to change that alright I'll start speeding up here I'll put it in the line to turn off our right turn signal I'll put on our left turn signal here Let's look. Um, yeah, we have an hour and five minutes left before we have to rest. So that will take us to six, actually, the six hours and thirty minutes. Oh, okay. Slow down, slow down. Slow down. Oh, there you go. Alright. So this is, like I said, um, as soon as I fill up with gas and park, I will end the video.
But yeah. But even seven hours, that that's still way below our uh, our time that I want. Alright guys, so until next time guys, until we we are able to continue this um, run and finish it, I will talk to you later. Hope you enjoyed this vi uh, video, um, hopefully see you in my live stream guys, until tomorrow, bye.